few days ago, this simulation video was shared in China. The Three Gorges Dam is 182 meters high and 2,355 meters wide and holds 39.3 billion cubic meters of water. When the Three Gorges Dam collapses, a huge 100 meter high water column explodes and hits the downstream. At the first, there are mountains on both sides, so the flood is not dispersed and the power is enormous. It flows at a terrifying speed of 100 km per hour. It is 50 km from Sri Gojo's Dam to Ichang, and within half hour, it destroys a Gojo Ba Dam and covers the city center of Ichang. The height of the flood is 20 meters, and the speed is 70 km per hour. Five hours later, Ichang's water level is 10 meters, and the city is completely submerged. Later, the water flowed to the large and the small cities around the Yangtze River with water speed of 60 km per hour. The waves are 15 to 20 meters high. The flood is going to a wide spread of plains. From this point, the area of damage increases as the flood spread in the sector from everywhere. The dispersing flood speed is reduced to 25 km per hour and the height is reduced to 8 meters. However, the mainstream of the Yangtze River still maintains a speed of 35 km per hour. The floods hit Jingzhou and directly go to Wuhan. It's 350 km from Three Gorges Dam to Yueyang, and it takes 5 hours to get here. When the mountain range is filled with the water, the peaks turn into islands. Dungting Lake is right next to Yueyang. In the dry season, it would act as a buffalo, but not now. The city of Yueyang is submerged by a depth of 5 meters of water. Largely spread flooding continues eastwards. It will pass the Tonghu Lake with the storage capacity of 16 billion cubic meters. It takes about 10 hours from Sri Gorges Dam to Wuhan. Wuhan is 18 to 40 meters above sea level and floods submerge the area 7 meters above sea level. At this time, some parts of Wuhan's downtown area may be safe, but 5 meters water depths will submerge in other parts of Wuhan. When the flood reaches the Wuhan, the surrounding terrain becomes suddenly narrow, making it difficult for water to disperse. This water will not drain easily, and the mountain picks up the Daibi Mountain and Lao Mountain in front of the Wuhan will create narrow waterways, so the water will be 6 to 8 meters deep. Floods are tapped in narrow waterways and the water rises also flows faster again. 15 hours after the collapse of the Sri Gorges Dam, water will arrive in Jiujiang, which is 1,000 kilometers away. There are many small lakes in Jiujiang, also Poyang Lake and many mountains. In the rainy season, the water level depth of Jiujiang city center is more than 7 meters. The storage capacity of Poyang Lake is 30 billion cubic meters, but it is not the dry season right now, so it can't mitigate the impact of the flood. The water keeps running. Water eventually floods a huge area of cropland. 24 hours after the dam collapse, the water arrives to Nanjing, a 1,500 km distance from Sri Gojo's Dam. When the flood reaches Nanjing, the disaster is basically over. However, during the rainy season, Nanjing is expected to suffer terrible damage. This Sri Gojo's Dam collapse simulation video is causing considerable waves in China, because in China, describing collapse of the Sri Gojo's Dam belongs to the taboo. It appears to have been produced by an expert, not an amateur, but it is not yet known who made the video. But this video shows the area of the Ichi city, the population density of the resident population, and the depths of the water when flooded. Share, please, and be safe.